Hey guys, um, so true last name. Okay, so, um, okay, I wanted to, um, the reason why I have you faced here is because I, I wrote this out and I've been studying for the past couple of days, which I already knew most of this, um, basically all of it almost, but there's hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of more of <clears throat> who we are in Christ Jesus. This is our identity. So I am basically just, how you say that? I'm just touching on it a tad bit. I'm just like very, 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 just very lightly touching on it. Okay. This is, there's, like I said, after this, there's hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds uh, more uh, of who we are in Christ Jesus. And so um, I wanted to show you like this because I didn't feel like typing it up <laughs> and I didn't feel like researching all these scriptures and putting them up on the screen so I, I so I'm gonna try to be fast because I don't I don't do videos this way no more Harley because it takes like over 24 hours just to upload and plus I want it to if I'm gonna teach something I want it to be I want you guys to actually look at the scriptures you know instead of me or whatever um who are you in Christ what is your identity in Christ Romans 8 37 to 39 we are more than conquerors okay Seven, uh, Second Corinthians five seventeen. We are new creatures, and if you're a spelling or language teacher, please do not rebuke me for my spelling and language. Thank you very much. Okay, Galat Galatians three twenty nine. We are heirs of the promise. Romans five seventeen. We have received abundance in grace. I wrote fast, so anyway. Ephesians two twelve. We have been brought nearer to God. Romans 5, 1, we have peace with God. We have Ephesians 2, 10, we are created to, for good works. It, but the good works does not save us, and, they, and we do not maintain our good works to keep our salvation. Colossians 2, 13, you have been made alive. Ephesians 4, 32, you are forgiven. As well as in Acts 10, 43, we are forgiven. Romans 5, 8, you are loved. John 1, 12 to 13, we are our, uh, children of God. Uh, Galatians 4, 4 to 5, you are adopted. 1 Corinthians 6, 11, you are sanctified. Romans 5, 10 through 11, you are uh, reconciled. We are reconciled um, back to Jesus. Romans 5, 9, we are saved from the wrath of God. I did a video before this video how we are not the children of disobedience and we are not the children of wrath. Romans 8, 1 to 2, you are free from the condemnation of sin. Philippians 4, 13, we are strong and courageous. 1 Corinthians 1, 30 to 31, we have wisdom because of Jesus. Romans 3, 22, we are the righteousness of Christ Jesus. Colossians 3, 1 through 4, Christ is your life. Galatians 2, 16, we are justified. 1 John 5, 11 through 12, we have eternal life. Ephesians 1 through 6, we are accepted by God. And I'm going to tell you this. There's hundreds and hundreds and hundreds more of who we are in Christ Jesus. We are conquerors, new, cre new create, uh, creatures, heirs of, the pom heirs of the promise, received abundance of grace, brought near to God, peace with God, created to do good works, made alive, forgiven, loved, children of God, adopted, sanctified, reconciled, uh, saved from the wrath. We are, we have no, we are free from condemnation. We are strong and courageous. We have wisdom. We are the righteousness of Christ Jesus. We are justified. We have eternal life. We are accepted by God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 And hallelujah and praise Jesus. It's all about the blood of Jesus.